Thought I'd show you the inside of it real quick. Once again, I'm gonna tell you there's something about the first time you sit in the hammock, especially. Like each each time you go camping, like the first time you get in it, it's like, oh my god, this is freaking awesome. This is what it looks like with no tarp. See, this is your view. You don't get this with a tent. I mean, you can, I suppose, but it depends on the top of your tent. The ones, the tents I have, you can't do this. Um. You can roll the tarp back as you want. Here's that little pocket. You get two pockets. Cell phone, light, little gun or something. Um, you got this wire. I hook my glow tube onto there so I can do my reading. Oh man, I'll tell you. I don't have this stretched out anymore. I took the stakes up, but... Oh, last night I put my leg out and just... Move it back and forth, let it and just swing. I mean, look at that view. Holy cow, man. There's a reason why I run out here, you know, and put up this hammock and eat on my little tiny stove. I love it. Uh, the only thing that kept, that got me up so far, I should have slept until nine, was the gunfire. Somebody's shooting guns over there, but. Um, you, you don't have to touch the ground to swing. Um, there's no bugs, so I didn't have to worry about that, but I put my leg out and didn't even touch the ground, just once you get going, it's just like a swing. So nice. This, uh, Smiler stuff worked out really well, you can definitely tell. Uh, thanks Dave Canterbury for that idea. It's also lightweight, that's what I like about it. Last night there were so many animals. Um, I I do this thing, you know, I have to look over and peek. You hear something walking, like I want to know what it is. Um, every now and then a leaf would fall on my... There's one right now. <laughs> a leaf would fall on my tarp and go, Shh, and it would kind of startle me. Every now and then though, uh, there's that gunfire. Every now and then though, a big branch would break and I'd hear walking. That always happens when I'm camping, but I what I would do is like, you know, it's dark, but I'd get up and I would like shine my light. Like I want to know what's out there, you know? I kind of want to identify it. Um, you know, I didn't sleep but probably four hours out of the eight last night, eight or nine. Maybe four and a half, but I feel great. Like, I feel really refreshed. I don't know how, I don't know why, but I feel really good. Like, I got plenty of rest. Um, sleeping in a hammock, um, for the most part, you're, you, you can stay like this and be pretty comfortable, but I like to move, so sometimes I go to my side, and then I roll up my, you can roll up your legs and it's a lot more stable. You can sleep on your side if you're a side sleeper like, like this. Uh, but one thing I don't like, like I said before, is that in a hammock you're always sliding towards the middle. So I find myself like doing this thing, pushing myself up. Now I feel good, but in like 20 minutes I'll be right back where I was again. <laughs> Still, the, the benefits outweigh the these little things I'm talking about. Um, I feel really secure in this thing. Like, I a lot of times I dig my elbow into it it's like that. You know, it's got to be sturdy, otherwise I'm gonna poke a hole in it eventually. It might take a year or two, but I sometimes I poke my elbow into it to move around because I'm always moving. So I just hope that it stands up to my abuse. And so far, it seems quite wonderful. This thing, I use this a lot, of course. It has everything I need. I, to be honest, I don't even want to leave. I like, I just, I want to make coffee and stuff, but I just want to sit here. Hammocks are freaking awesome, man.
You got to get one. I'm not going back. <laughs> Thanks for staying with me for this video. Hasta luego.